hello everyone welcome back to my unreal engine tutorial series so today uh, i'm going to work on some improvements to my bow and arrow mechanics so these are the mechanics that i have improved from last time so now as you can see there is an uh, arrow and the arrow is aligned with the crosshair in the middle and also um, the bow is uh, bow string is uh, drawn by the hand and when I put it back there is no arrow and the bow is normal and the reticle is gone the crosshair is gone and also you can you may notice that uh, my camera is moving to the right of the character smoothly and moving back to the behind smoothly unlike before uh, as I equip the bow and release the bow so let's work on those things today and uh, as always this episode is sponsored by these awesome people thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me alright so let's uh, start working with uh, aligning the arrow towards the crosshair so now this is my current implementation and as you can see this uh, my crosshair is in the middle but my arrow is pointing elsewhere first I feel this crosshair is a little bit too large so I'll go to my widget and reduce its size to 50-50 compile and also I keep I kept the spring arm length when my character is aiming as 300 and FOV to 70 and also socket offset I changed it uh, uh, in the y direction about 100 units so all right let's see it again right now I think crosshair is pretty decent than it was before okay now let's work on uh, aligning the no before aligning part I I would like to fix this uh, arrow I want to draw the uh, bow with this animation <coughs> it's here PP and weapons and yeah and the bow and arrow I have this bow animation so I'm going to make my bow like this when it's drawn and when I release it should go back to like this so for that let's create an animation montage all right and here I'll define a new montage section I'll call it draw and a little bit after that I'll create a new montage section release now I want to make this drawn part looping so like this it would be like this and only when I play the release part it would be uh, it would be it would go back to the normal state okay so then mm, I'll open my bow blueprint and here yeah actually when I make this uh, arrow stick visible I'll play that animation montage so that my bow will be drawn play animation 
can I use this one? Okay. And the uh, montage is bow any montage. Right. Let's see how it looks. No, it's not working. What's the issue? Alright, uh, I think I can't use this one because I'm not using an animation blueprint. So instead, I'll just simply play animation. And for the animation, I'll give you any montage. And yeah, this should be played only if um, I'm enabling or drawing my bow. All right, let's see how it looks. Okay, now you can see the bow is drawn, but when I release it, it is still in uh, like that. So I need to reset that one. So when this is false, I should play animation. Let's use the same note. And here. Uh, since I am using just the play animation node, I can't define this section here. Uh, so therefore, I'll duplicate this one and delete this one and this one. I think I only need this last part so how can I include only on that part only that part uh, let's remove these sections how can I remove a section okay Let's clear this. This. I don't know. Let's uh, create the animation from montage from scratch. Let's just delete this one and create an a montage for I'll call it for release and. I only need this part so therefore I'll start my animation the total from point 4 right that's good now I'll play that one for release let's see Okay, is uh, the bow is drawn and yeah, now it's normal. All right, that part is fixed, and I think I'll stop the today's episode at this point. And the, in the next episode, I'll show you how to align uh, this uh, arrow and the crosshair in the middle. Because if I do it in the this in this part, then this part will become too long. And also, I'll upload the updated project files 
into my patreon page and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of my patreon club and depending on the tier you join you will have different privileges as i have explained here all right um see you in the next episode goodbye